Hey everyone, this is Stacy. I thought I would go ahead and do the tag, the um, seven, <clears throat> excuse me, the seven deadly sins of beauty tag, and I will just go ahead and get started. Um, excuse me if I'm looking down. I have my iPad right here with the questions, and the first question is about greed, and it says, "What is your most inexpensive beauty item?" And then, "What is your most expensive?" And for me, I'd say probably my most inexpensive items are my Wet n Wild products. Um, nail polishes and eyeshadows. I think they make some really great products. Um, I think they start at like 99 cents, so you can't beat that. And what is your most expensive beauty item? And I will show you. My most expensive beauty item is probably um, something that I actually got as a gift um, from my friend Amy, and it's the Tom Ford um, eyeshadow quad. I just thought I'd grab that um, real quick. And this is the color um, golden mink and these run like $75 and um, she gifted me this for um, I think it was for Christmas this year so thank you Amy for my most expensive beauty item the next question is wrath and it says what beauty products do you have a love-hate relationship with um, I think maybe love-hate kind of thing for me would be maybe just some sort of facial type products um, different moisturizers and things, just not knowing how my skin will react to them, whether it's something that I buy that's expensive and then my face breaks out, or, um, you know, I just have some bad reaction to it or something. So I guess that would kind of be it. And then what product has been the hardest to get? Um, I don't really think I've had a, a really, really hard time finding anything. I kind of give up if I can't find things um, after a while. I know that like when the Wet n Wild those um, eight pan palettes came out. I remember just going and going to, you know, a hundred different Walgreens until I finally found them. So, I mean, in that sense, I would say hard to get. Um, and then another one would be like that Estee Lauder Illuminating um, Jelly, 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 whatever that came out in that Modern Mercury correct collection. And um, I mean, I looked for it for a little while, but then. Um, gave up and then lo and behold my sweet friend Sonata had sent it to me so as a gift so um, that would maybe be the answer for that one. Um, gluttony is what are your most delicious beauty products and for me um, delicious beauty products just kind of refers to the scent because I love um, products that smell like food and I just grabbed a couple. The um, Berry M lip glosses smell really really good. They have a great foodie smell. Maybe kind of like a fruit and a vanilla together or something. I'm not sure, but they smell really good when they're on your lips. And then the sheer color from the uh, Rouge Volup from the sheer ones. I don't know what it's called. Sorry. That I got recently. Um, this particular one is the, like the sheer one. And they smell like mango. They smell really fabulous. So anything that kind of smells like food, I love. I love my perfumes that have that vanilla undertone, um, like vanilla citrusy things and vanilla, just vanilla-based things. Um, so that's what I like. Um, sloth, what beauty product do you neglect due to laziness? Um, let's see. I guess, like, sometimes I won't put my sunscreen on under my makeup. I'll just be kind of lazy and just go for the SPF 45 BB cream if I'm too lazy to, you know, do two steps. So that kind of thing, maybe. But I do wear my sunscreen in that way. Let's see. What beauty product gives you the most confidence? And I would say for me, um, if I had to say a single product, I would say probably mascara because I like long lashes because I like um, just the expressive open eye look. Um, second would probably be, you know, lipsticks and lip glosses and stuff like that. Let's see. So that was pride. And then lust. What attributes do you most, do you find most attractive in the opposite sex? And I would say, um, confidence, intelligence, um, I don't know. Um, I mean, looks obviously are important. Um, you know, I look at, eyes, of course, because, you know, they say looking in someone's eyes, you can see their soul kind of thing, but um, just like a, you know, a kind heart, um, that kind of stuff. 
and then Envy says, what items would you most like to receive as a gift? Um, I don't really know. Um, hmm, as a gift. Let's see. I mean, I guess it's not really necessarily beauty. I mean, you guys know I'm into my jewelry, my accessories and jewelry kind of stuff. I'm, you know, diamonds are girl's best friend. Um, love to get my diamonds as a gift, you know. My hubby does really well with that kind of stuff. Um, but as far as a beauty item as a gift, um, maybe just going and getting a facial or a massage kind of a thing. So anyway, um, I tag anyone else that wants to do this. I think it's kind of a fun tag. Interesting to hear what people have to say as their answers. And I am off now to go color my hair. Um, I don't color my hair very often, and I'm not going to get too close to the camera here, but I parted my hair kind of in this wide part today, and then all of a sudden I could see these silvery hairs um, peeking through because I kind of had a different part, and that did not make me very happy. That kind of scared me. So I'm going to go color those, um, leave those on and watch some YouTube videos while I'm doing that. And then I also wanted to let you know that I just started a new blog and um, my really, really sweet friend from Kosovo named Azra, and she does have a channel. Um, I don't think she does videos really very often and I really wish she would because she's a beautiful person and it's just so amazing to me the international difference between us, but there's really no communication gap. It's pretty cool. So um, I'll put her link below, and she's the one that helped me with my new blog. So if you want to check that out, I would really appreciate it, and I will put the link to that below as well. Hope everyone's having a good day. Thanks so much for watching.